A wow. clip of Howie hitting the golden buzzer. You said uh, you were moved there. You physically moved now into your closet with your nice wood <laughs> hangers. Yes, I know that. I got, I'm being asked to leave. I just got banished from my own bedroom. <laughs> uh, things aren't going well, good. But let me talk about that clip for a second. You know, yeah. uh, during the pandemic, obviously, we're all doing things a little differently, and that's when we lost the audience. And it's hard for me to believe, after 15 years and all the talent that we've seen on that show, this is the first time we've had a spoken word artist. And had you told me that I was about to see one, I'm, I, I don't know that I was even really aware of that kind of poetry. Or I, I know it existed, but I don't know anything about it. And I got to tell you, the fact that there was no audience there and he, Brandon Lee, was just there, it was the most moving uh, performance I had almost seen this year. It just moved my heart, and I just hit that golden buzzer, Whoa. and he's going right to the live shows, which premiere coming this Tuesday. We're going live in a way we've never done it before. So, it's Tia, going tell to be us how you're going to do it. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> so, no, first live just, shows no, are back no. next week? We are back on Tuesday. I, I'll tell you, to be totally honest with you, I don't know, but I know where, you know, we're going to be seeing them live on the back lots of, NB, of uh, Universal, and it's just uh, going to be crazy. And it's been off the hook. You know, our judge cuts, what aired, which aired last week, were even better than our judge cuts normally when this is not going on. And so much so that Simon even said, if we should be lucky enough to come back next year, that's exactly the way he wants to do it. Wow. I, th rather than performing on the stages, on you know, just a, a closed-in stage, we're out in the open, and the performances were in the desert. We're in the, you know, that's for the the judge cuts. Now they have the whole back lot, and we'll be able to stand there live and watch them use whatever Universal can supply to to us at a at a studio. Yeah, I think it's going to be bigger and more exciting than it's ever been, and so is the talent this year. And how about oh, Sofia cool. Vergara? She's now in the mix. How has that changed oh, up the dynamic? Oh, wow. Just, uh, you didn't, I didn't know with, with me there, I didn't know there could be any more gorgeousness. And then, you know, Heidi came back, <laughs> who I love. And now Sofia, who is just so beautiful, so funny, so smart, and uh, just a, an amazing addition to this uh, extravaganza. I love her. It's my new friend, and she has been so great. In fact, there's a good possibility that her golden buzzer may win this whole thing this year. Wow. You know, Aww. I remember, you brought up Simon, I remember when he was launching the show, um, talking about the show, and how this show is timeless. I mean, I think this show can be on, America's Got Talent can be on forever. There's just so many great performers out there, and like you said, the spoken word, on paper would have sounded like something that wouldn't have struck you so much, but we can't wait to see it all, Howie. Thanks for coming on.